Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given system of rational equations that involve radicals. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first step we are going to do. And now let's focus on the very first equation. I can write this equation as 2 times 1 over square root of x likewise plus 3 times this could be written as 1 over square root of y equals to 2 and likewise I can write this second equation as 4 times 1 over square root of x minus 9 times 1 over square root of y equals to negative 1. Now let me go ahead and call this first equation as equation number one and this as equation number two. And now in order to make our job simpler, let's go ahead and make a substitution. I am going to call this as an a and this one as an a as well and this one over square root of y as a b and likewise one over square root of y as b. So let's suppose that our a is 1 over square root of x and likewise b is 1 over square root of y. Then our equations 1 and 2 simply become 2a plus 3b equals to 2 and the second equation is going to become 4a minus 9b equals to negative 1. And now let me go ahead and call these equations, this one as equation number 3 and this as an equation number 4. And now we are going to solve these equations 3 and 4 for a and b values. And we are going to use the elimination method. In order to use elimination method, we are going to multiply this equation 3 by 3 across the board. So equation 3 is going to become, if we multiply by 3, so this is going to become 6a plus 9b equal to 6. And now we are going to add this equation to equation 4. And here's our equation 4. Let's go ahead and add them. 6a plus 4a is going to give us 10a. This positive 9b and negative 9b, they are gone. And on the right hand side, we got 5. Let's divide both sides by 10. So our a value turns out to be 1 over 2. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and substitute a equals to 1 over 2 value in this equation 3. And here's our equation number 3. Let's go ahead and replace this a value by 1 over 2. So therefore, we are going to get 2 times 1 over 2 plus 3 times b equals to 2. 2 times 1 over 2 is simply gives us 1 plus 3b equals to 2. And if we simplify, we're going to get 3b equals to 1. That means our b value is going to be simply 1 over 3. So thus, we have found out our a equals to 1 over 2 value and b is 1 over 3. But we know our a equals to 1 over square root of x. So therefore, I can write 1 over 2 equal to 1 over square root of x. And now we got these two fractions. And if we take the reciprocal on both sides, if we flip them over, we can write this thing as 2 over 1 equal to square root of x divided by 1. So we got square root of x equal to 2. Let's go ahead and undo this square root by taking the square on both sides. The square and square root is gone. So our x value turns out to be 2 square is same as x equal to 4 value. 
and we also know that b equals to 1 over square root of y and now I'm going to replace b by 1 over 3 so I can write 1 over 3 equal to 1 over square root of y let's flip both side over so this could be written as 3 over 1 equal to square root of y divided by 1 let's go ahead and take the square on both sides so that means our y value turns out to be 9 so thus our solution turns out to be x equal to 4 and y equals to 9 and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye